somebody said, what's your favorite sex position? <laughs> but yeah, if you don't know what that is, then I don't know what to tell you. Ben and Noah, about to back. Now I really be like, fuck that nigga. My attitude changed. Take a couple sips of the douce. Ain't no ring on my finger anyway. And I miss the dick, but that'll go away. I just gotta stop. Hey everybody, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl, Tierra Beauty. And today, as you can tell by the title, we're doing a spicy Q&A. So, yes, we're about to get right into it. So, y'all, I've been keeping my mother looking promise. I've been posting every day for, wait, I've been posting every week, one day. <laughs> and that makes sense. I might have said that wrong, but whatever. So, anywho, um, yeah, uh, we're about to do a spicy q and I post on my instagram i posted my instagram people be acting like they scared they were scared to ask me questions but i got a, um like seven questions for my instagram and and i post on facebook my facebook story and i say i'm gonna show y'all what i said this is what i said i don't know if you actually did but i say i'm doing a q a for my channel i know i said I, i'm doing a spicy q a for my channel see me some good ass questions so that's basically what i said um so anywho's the girls been sending the questions honey so anyways before we get into this y'all i want to show y'all my chocolate covered strawberries i made earlier and they look fat as hell one moment y'all look at it i made it look at this one the chocolate well, they're not the best y'all but these are my first time making this and i tried to mix it this is my favorite i this is um vanilla white chocolate coconut y'all i've been liking coconut so i gotta like this mm. Cold, so that's why I do it. Why am I messing up? Mm. 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 Okay with me. By my car. Mm. Mm. Okay. I'm gonna do this for the video. Mm. I'm not a big fan of the chocolate one, but I'm just bite it just because I'm on camera. We have half candle. Hmm. Okay. Shut up. Come on. Can't forget the drink. Oh, I'm done eating. Let's get into this. All right. I'm just go down the road, cause yeah. Y'all ready for these? I I peeked at the questions. Yes, I did, y'all. People. Mm -mm. All right, y'all. First question. Somebody said, "What's your biggest turn off in a person?" Um, it would have to be somebody that can't kiss, or with some ugly teeth. Cause like, if you can't kiss and you got ugly teeth, that's just like a no for me. So yeah. <laughs> If y'all hear some stuff, that's my nephew downstairs. This house echo, ink we hear everything, literally. So, second question. What's your biggest 
turn on in a person. That's why they can kiss. <laughs> because I'm telling you, somebody they can kiss is the best. For real. That's just my opinion. Y'all, get into the lip gloss. All right. Third question. Have you been in love? Child, too many times. <laughs> I just plan, but y'all have. Somebody said, Have you ever given or received a hickey? Okay, y'all, let me tell y'all. I don't like hickeys personally, and I don't think that's cute. I don't think that's attractive. Like, no. I had a hickey before, but it was just like we was in a moment. I just let him suck on my neck. But, and I gave him a hickey before, but this is my ex. But, I don't like hickeys. I, I truly don't. I feel like that's just doing too much. I, I've seen a lot of people come to work before with hickeys all over their neck. Like, nobody needs to know what you're doing in the bedroom. Nobody needs to know that you're getting some dick. Like, it's obviously, girl, you got all them hickeys on your neck. And they'll try to, like, put makeup on it and try to cover it up. I don't think that's cute at all. Like, we all know you get getting some. You don't have to come to work with hella hickeys. You know, a simple hickey, that's that's cool. But I'm not about to put a little nigga suck on my neck. And people be, be outrageous with it. They be putting hickeys on their cheek and stuff. Like, no. That's just not for me. Somebody said, um, have you ever led a person on? Yes, I have. But nothing happened. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> nah, no. But for real, for real, nothing happened. Um... Somebody said, have you ever used somebody for your own personal gain? No, I don't think, no. No, no, I did not. Somebody said, what is the best gift you ever received sexually? <laughs> hey, duh. <laughs> I just slid. Um, somebody said, What's your favorite sex position? <laughs> but yeah. If you don't know what that is, then I don't know what to tell you. Ben and Dawn. Um, somebody said, where is the wildest place you ever hooked up with someone before? The wildest place? It would have to be in a car. Like, people, I know a couple of people, like, I watch, no, I don't know them, but I have seen, like, well, yes, I do. I, I, been, I watch other people, like, Q&As, like, spicy Q&As, and I know a couple of people that, like, they, wow, this place they had sex with is outrageous. Like, somebody, I know somebody that had sex in the alley before. Like, what are you, a hooker? For real, that's just a no for me. I'm not having sex in the lobby in the alley. I mean, if you down horny. You might as well have sex in the garbage can. <laughs> Not just playing, but that just really wild. And some people have said they had sex at work in the bathroom. I mean, that's common. People does that. But no, the wildest will have to be in a car. In a car, in a house, that's it. Nowhere else. No, that shit's dead. Um, somebody said, what is something you want? more of in your sex life so what is something you want more of in your sex life role play <laughs> y'all i will be it will be so like i feel like that would be the funniest with me if i role play with somebody i kid you not i want to be just like it the clown you feel what i'm saying and i want to hold a red balloon and i just want to chase you <laughs> i want to chase you and i want you to run from me like for real i really want to just like a clown and role play and I want to chase you. <laughs> That's so creepy in there, but dead ass. <laughs> that is so weird. Not that like I'm actually saying it and y'all go. You know what I'm saying? Somebody said, have you ever got your ass beat? Um, somebody said, was you, would you ever have a threesome? Yes, but only with two girls and me and they both have to be a stud and they gotta be bad as fuck 
I want to have sex with two studs that look like a nigga. But I just don't want to have sex with two men. That's just dead. But I do want to have sex with two girls. If I feel like that'd be lit. Somebody said, do you have a man? No. Um, I'm single to further notice. Yeah. Um, somebody said, when is the last time you had sex? You in my business? Huh? You in my business? Don't do that. Um, somebody said, at what age did you have your first sexual experience? I, I think I said that. I think I said that before. I don't know. I'm going to have to look at the video when it's over. But I was 17. It actually happened on my 17th birthday with my ex. So, yeah. 17th birthday. Hey, that was my first, like, first time, you know. Um. Somebody said, what is one thing you want to do sexually before you die? This might be a little creepy, but I want to have sex with a midget. <laughs> Y'all, for real. I feel like that would be so funny and fun. You know what I'm saying? Imagine having sex with a girl midget. They be thick as fuck. They be thick as fuck. And I feel like they so adorable and creepy at the same time. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> last question. Somebody said, who's the last person you had sex with? Who's the last person your mother had sex with? Okay. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is the end of this spicy q and If you want a part two, give this video a big thumbs up. Follow all my social medias down below. Comment down below and let me know what you want to see next. And also, you guys, I want y'all to go follow my TikTok. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.